Good morning, everyone. My name is Charlotte Lohanathan, and this is my fifth model from Kids Speak Today. Today, I'm going to present to you with the model, and the title of my story is The Wise King. Once there lived a king, his name was King Solomon. King Solomon was one of many sons of King David. He was famous throughout the land. His people lived happily because he was a kind leader. King Solomon ruled with wisdom for 40 years. Rulers from far and we, not only was his wise, but his subjects also loved him very much. One day, a queen from a nearby country came to visit him. She wanted to test King Solomon's power of solving puzzles. She said, Your Majesty, I have two flowers in my head. One is real and the other is artificial. I want to take a guess which is real and the other is artificial without touching or smelling it. King Solomon closed his eyes and started thinking. He opened his eyes and he looked around. He then closed his eyes again and he went into a deep thought and there was complete silence. The queen was happy because she thought that King Solomon did not know the answer. God shouted the king, open all the windows of the palace so that the fresh air can come in. The gods opened all the windows of the palace. At that time, a few butterflies flew into the room and settled on the flower on the queen's right hand. At that time, the butterflies flew onto the flower on the queen's left hand, and they spent no longer time sucking the nectar from it. The wise king said, The flower in the right hand is artificial, whereas the flower in the left hand is real. How do you know? asked the queen. Only real flowers have nectar, and the butterflies were trying to suck nectar from it. The queen said, you are truly a wise king. The moral of the story is, creativity is the best problem solving tool. You need to get creative, you need to get creative to solve your problems. Thank you.